So, a new video from me. I have a lot to say and a lot to bring up, so in the course of this very, very possibly long video, I decided to put in some gameplay in order to not make you bored, along with some accompanying music in order to explain myself on, well, what the hell happened? Why did I stop doing YouTube? And well, let's just say, uh, due to the fact that real life is a fucking bitch sometimes, I decided to leave YouTube on a big hiatus. And as you all know, when uh, when YouTube knows that somebody's on a big hiatus, they uh, they uh, they don't like that. They don't really like that all that much. So what they essentially do is essentially blacklist you and never hear from you again until you start uploading videos constantly and daily and daily. And that can be taxing to a man, especially someone like me who has to literally deal with not just YouTube, but college and the fact that I have my own priorities elsewhere, like writing or, or something akin to those lines. So, what have I been up to since yeah, I was gone? Well, besides college, of course, uh, nothing much, really. I kind of did go into a lazy state. Um, yeah, I went fucking lazy, and that is inexcusable to someone of my stature. And the fact that I went, I even went lazy at all, is because I myself uh, am a like a fucking lazy person. I never, ever set anything to like my maximum effort i never really go too far with it unless if it's something i love and youtube is something i love i don't get me wrong i love the fact that you guys are here watching my content and all that but the fact that it's old content kind of relegates it back to a lo lower timeline especially my old overwatch especially my overwatch videos now it's get it's hard to watch my overwatch videos now because of it and it's really kind of you know I, I don't want to say it but even though that overwatch is still kind of sort of popular it has been gone from the uh, general gaming scene for a long time that it's pretty much it's a thing that everyone just talks really but never really says anything about it and it's high praises and the fact that I really don't have any more Overwatch videos is a kind of a bummer in its own case. And, well, I just didn't get got bad bother to it. And the fact that also my software decided to fuck up a lot of it. Actually, you know, I'm recording this on Audacity, actually. I recorded videos on my own and then sent it over to a friend of mine who's editing this right now. Um... I'll, I'll explain that later, but for now, uh, basically my software fucked up and I didn't want to make videos for a long, long time. And that it wasn't until I had the idea for a game that's gonna recently come out that I'm about to pre-order, uh, and it'll be coming by August, uh, probably, if I can muster the time to even do that. And, but yeah, for the most part, I've been mostly exactly out of the internet. I've been out of the internet for like a long time, like in terms of doing stuff in popularity. I'm still there. It's just that I don't necessarily stop. I don't necessarily do videos anymore. And I, I kind of just gave up on it and for a long time it's kind of hopeless to do that until I found myself some new software, I found myself some new things to use to record, I now use OBS instead of Bandicam because apparently people don't really like Bandicam all that much even though for me it has been decent, it has been serving with me for a long time but now I guess it's Bandicam's problem because now it has audio issues and the fact that Camtasia didn't really help either kind of serves up to that point. So I decided to move up to Movavi Video Suite. Um, uh, as for 
va uh, video ideas. Don't worry. I, I, I've actually, like, a lot of plans incoming. But uh, for videos, I decided that only sometimes, only on those times where I feel way too busy to edit and record. Like, not just to record, but record and edit all in one go in one day. I decided to essentially, you know, ask the help of a temporary editor. And my temporary editor is the one editing this video right now. His name is Bones. He's introducing himself throughout the screen right now. You can check out his Twitch channel that I will link in the description below because I have been there as his modder and not only that, he's been getting a little bit slightly higher on Twitch and we do a podcast together called the, called the Spudcast where we basically talk about shit and you know it's kind of like that. Basically he's a guy that does editing really well and he does it with so much effort that I could barely even hope to match him what with my older videos being essentially just shortened versions of like normally long videos that I used to upload and that's not exactly good. I needed better. I needed to better my cont content and all that. But I guess jump cuts is good anyway. But I mostly did record myself. I record and then I edit and then I just send it. I just you know upload them. But now I'm getting to those points where if I can't, like I don't have the time to do it. I just I don't want to delay it another day, I don't want to delay it another time, and because like YouTube's fucking merciless, if I don't upload, da upload daily, it will eat my asshole, so I decided to send it, to <laughs> oh god, uh, I decided to send it over to my editor, and he will edit those videos and then send them back to me as a Google Drive link, and I will fucking download them, and I will uh, fucking upload them to YouTube. So essentially, most of the work, most of the meat work, I guess, is done by him, and I gladly appreciate him for that, for taking over my work. And when I have super free time, that's where I come in, and you will see the various changes to our styles of editing. Uh, in the fact that in his videos is probably gonna be a lot more better than mine. <laughs> his videos are probably gonna be a lot more better edited and shot than mostly of what I do, which is just really just random jump cuts and just posting of text on the screen that just fucking essentially just uh, does a thing. It tells some things or some shit like that, or whenever I uh, shoddily like um, put in some super ingrained background music just so that uh, it doesn't bo uh, just so that uh, I would deal something in my record situation instead of recording again like a massive fucking bitch uh, because I do not like to handle that as for video ideas I have considered and uh, again I have a new LP come through a new normal LP not the trickster LP not one of the Trickster LPs, of course, because I didn't really necessarily do much for Stardew Valley, and I doubt I'll come back again unless if I have like multiplayer with friends or something like that. That maybe on it like a tr like, not like a normal multiplayer LP on Stardew Valley, if that's ever possible, because me and my and my friends haven't had the game yet, so I can't necessarily come back to it for the most part, and it's kind of ridiculous, and. It would be very boring. It's all like Stardew Valley is only good for streaming for the most part, and I kind of regret that in myself that I decided to do it as a Let's Play series because using uh, games like Stardew Valley as a Let's Play series, let alone anything that's like Stardew Valley, like Harvest Moon or something, it'll take a long fucking time to actually get anything done, and I didn't really necessarily want to do anything with that shit. And it's kind of frustrating and annoying, and I just didn't want to fucking do it. But with this new LP series, I'm actually motivated because it is a game that I have been treasuring for a long time that's now coming back to the PC. And I'm pretty sure you'll get that hype that, for that once I come to my video. So, what do you. So, um. I think, uh, the question that, uh, you should ask is what do we expect from. Trickster coming back to the gaming scene after for so long, after for so many, many, many goddamn days of neglect and fucking essentially leaving his uh, channel to die. 
Well, for the first part, I think I'll be starting to upload more and more scheduled videos with the fact that um, Dragon Ball Fighters is still pretty pretty popular and I will fucking make posts of those uh, as much as I can. It's kind of like my new Overwatch now, I guess. Um, and then there's also uh, games like um, like the new LP that I promised you that will be normal playthroughs where it's just me and me alone and I kind of do that on a regular daily basis so I just do it because you know what fuck it it's it's what I do as a ch as a content creator and I personally don't know I haven't yet planned that far ahead I don't usually tend to fucking go uh, far with my own LP ideas, but whenever I do, it's usually the ones that work. <coughs> but for the most part, the trickster is back, and the trickster is gonna be gonna be returning very, very soon with hopefully some new content and probably some something that will just make it a lot better. So, I mean. My fellow tricksters and Harlequins, well, I'll be back, just self-assured, but I don't know if, it, if I'm ever going to be having that same pep I did when I did my videos from way back when. It'll probably happen, most likely with a new LP again. I'm chilling a lot, and I'm just, like, delaying myself for this whole fucking thing. Uh, but for the most part, uh, the... The Trickster LPs are, uh, well, the Trickster LPs and normal LPs, they will never stop. They will never ever stop. They haven't yet died yet. So, for the most part, yeah. that's it. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say, like, uh, I've been dealing with life. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be doing videos from that. I'm gonna be doing videos on my own free time from now on. I'll be probably trying to upload daily because I need to persevere. I need to get to the top. I, I liked YouTube for a long time and essentially this is my way of saying that I like the fucking things that I've been doing and I think it's time I deserve better. I need to do better and I need to fucking get on with my life a lot more than I should have instead of just neglecting my own fucking channel much like a fucking druggy or some fucking asshole would abandon their child because in that end i like doing youtube i love doing youtube youtube's my fucking passion and all that but sometimes life just gets in the way and it doesn't really necessarily help all that much so i might as well start you know doing some work i need to prove that i love doing this job i need to know uh, i need to fucking actually give the fans what they want and what they want is more of me so i might as well do that i might as well give the fans what they need and do more videos on it because honestly i love doing this stuff and i bet you like it too so i just basically want to come back and i'm just rambling now over and over again i just i really need to end this video a lot more a lot more uh, pace. Uh, fuck. I just need to end the video a lot more proper than I did. So, keep an eye out for those videos. They'll be coming soon. And, uh, well, I'll say this. Till then, keep on shocking.